Baez, first pitch swinging, high and deep, and it'll go! Long gone to right center, Javier Baez, Cubs lead one to nothing. And listen to the Cub fans here in Seattle. Yeah, we've seen him do this a number of times this year. Ambush that first pitch fastball. And again, uh, shooting the ball to the big part of the yard. He's in a number of his home runs. Most of his home runs have been right, right, central. Or Baez, his 10th of the year, opposite field, towering drive. Baez, fair ball. Deflected off the glove of Healy. Zobrist scores. Bryant to third. Baez is two for two in this inning with a homer, a double, and two knocked in. Six zip. I would say he's having a pretty good day here in Seattle. Well, there's no doubt he's the player of the inning, right? Incredible. In the right. Caught by Hayes. No. They said he trapped it. I think he thinks he caught it. Maybe not. And I think they're going to look at this, but I think the replay in center field, the big scoreboard, Hayward saw that he caught it, and they're going to review this, I'm going to guess. We're looking at it now in our booth, and yeah, that's a catch. Diving backhand catch. Only Jason Hayward could have made that play. I can't think of another guy who could have made that catch, Ron. Dive, slide on a ball hit in front of you. Nobody gets a better break on the ball hit in front of him in right field than Jason Hayward. Bunt pushes it toward third. It's a good bunt, stays fair. That's a base hit. You can't defend this guy. Is he gonna hit it over the wall or drop down a bunt on you? Excellent bunt. You couldn't roll this ball out there any better. It stays right down the line and stays in the infield grass. Gonzalez comes over. The ball stops rolling about halfway to third base and it's a base hit. Kyle Hendricks goes all the way and shuts out the Cardinals by a score of four to nothing. An 81 pitch complete game shutout for Kyle Hendricks. A four hitter, all of the hits were singles. He walked no one and he is being congratulated or at least he will be here in a moment by all of his Cub teammates. That is in the masterpiece category. Call him the professor, but it was uh, an artist at work here this afternoon. It was so much fun to watch this guy do his thing. Davis in the air, deep left, it is gone! That's a grand slam! The tie the game! Oh, baby! What a moment, what a moment for Taylor Davis. First major league home run. First hit of the year. And now the 2-2 from Leon. Oh, out to deep center field. Bader back. And it's gone! On cue! A grand slam for Chris Bryant. And the Cubs have turned it into a rout. Straight away center, landed in the first row. Bryant with a grand slam, and the Cubs now lead 13 to two. The exclamation mark by Chris Bryant on this series. The Cubs play a great series, dominate the series, and KB with the grand slam now here in the bottom of the eighth. Hit a ton. Number 200. Anthony Rizzo gives the Cubs the lead. He hit it right through the wind. Right into the teeth of the wind. Maybe 20 feet from the hitting background and straightaway center, but a rocket to left center field for Riz. And I would say he is hot. He is absolutely swinging the bat. 200, all but one of them have come in the uniform of the Chicago Cubs. More runs, right in the air deep. Is it enough? It's gone! Ball game over! Cubs win! Cubs win! 
and his teammates jumping up and down at home plate. What a finish. As you said, Pat, into the teeth of the wind the last time KB had done that. Cleveland 2015, and he absolutely waffles this ball in the left center field. Game over. Rizzo pounces on it, they get one, that'll be it. Excellent play by Anthony Rizzo. Nicely played by the Gold Glover. He's gonna show Bunt and Bunt it in the air. It's gonna be caught by Rizzo, he lets it drop. Anthony steps on the bag and now they've got a man in a rundown. For some reason Herrera gets caught in the rundown, he's out. So again. How about that by Anthony Rizzo? And now the one-two from Pijada. Hayward hits a fly ball to deep left field. Back goes Granderson. It's got a chance. It's over. Cubs win again. Hayward does it tonight. Back-to-back -to -back nights, walk-off game-winning home runs. How about that? Trying to make a habit out of it. Well, we talk about it. That's number six for Hayward and walked off RBI. And what he does is he lets that ball get deep. We talked about him shooting it the other way. Wind blowing out to left. Dumps it in the basket. Cubs win. The 2 2. He just punches that one out in the right center. Bodie on his way to third. He's going to try to score. Relay. Save. Somehow he got his hand in to tie the game. David Bodie with an outstanding slide, head first, beating the throw on the RBI double by Albert Almora Jr. well that ends well and in 15 innings the Cubs have beaten Milwaukee by a score of two to one I had to wait it was right down the line as it turned out it was gone by plenty I never did see where it landed I saw Joe West the third base umpire point toward fair territory it's getting to be a habit around here And this one was a long one, and this has been a long, tough day. And we had just said Contreras had some really good swings this at bat, and he connects with the last one, and it lands in the last row down the left field line in the well. Hey, he's, you know, he's playing like Scooter Jeanette. That's deep. Almora at the fence, and he leaps, and he caught it! What a play by Almora! Don't know if it would have been a homer, but at least two bases for Dietrich. Two down. Yeah, tower and drive, that ball slicing away from Almore. I love the reaction by Hendricks. Dietrich has got serious power and he's given a long look. He thinks he knocked it out of here. It was high enough, but just a little bit to the left of that yellow line to the higher part of the wall. Pitch on the way to Kyle. Swung on, hitting the air to center field. Back goes Senzel. That's over his head. It's up against the center field fence. Two runs are going to score. And the Cubs strike first here in the second inning. Fourth career double for Kyle. We talk about an ambush. Two quick outs, fly ball, punch out. Descalzo drops down the bunt. More a solid single at Hendricks. Well, so much for that idea of flipping the lineup over. How about just driving in a couple runs as Kyle Hendricks gets a pitch up and out over the plate and just hammers this ball to straightaway center field. Senzel playing shallow and around towards right center, and Kyle just pounds this ball to the trap. Look at Hendricks. Kyle Hendricks is two for two. Rod Cruz, and finally, my lessons are paying off. 
Double over sends Al's head. Now he dumps his line drive single in front of him. He is now two for two. He has hit the ball right on the money each time. And he's telling first base coach Chris Denorfia, you know, there's really nothing to this hitting business. Throw him a strike. Let him hit it. <laughs> well, it is bark in the park night. Here's the 3 2 pitch. Line toward left center field. That's a base hit. And he's got a three hit game for the first time. What a night for Kyle Hendricks. And Kyle Hendricks, that famous slugger, has just lashed out his third hit of this game. Three for four. The only time he was retired, he hit a whistling liner to second base. Is he using an axe bat? <laughs> and nothing cheap about any of his hits, man. He's been hanging out line drives all night long. The only out was a rocket to second base. And it's on the way to Bryant. Chris will hit a fly ball into deep left center field. Back goes Soto. It's got a chance at the wall. Gone. Two run home run, Chris Bryant. Cubs lead by a score of five to two. That ball landed in the Cub bullpen. And for Chris Bryant, his ninth home run. And the Cubs have a little breathing room here in our nation's capital. In the air off the bat of Brian. Mark. Number two tonight. A majestic towering blast for his tenth of the year. Eight to four. That ball was up there forever. Yeah, it was. There's some serious hang time. It's a young man with tremendous power. They go back to back. Bryant drives one in the air, deep left center. This ball's got a chance. Chris Bryant with a hat trick. His third homer of the night. All three have landed in the Cubs bullpen in left center. This was a screaming line drive. What a night for KB. Can you give him the double Benny's player of the game? Can we double it up? Sure. Right? He chose for the game ball play. Sure we can. Three bombs for KB. Two two-run homers and a solo shot. And the pitch bounced weakly past the mound, charging Baez, barehanding, throwing the first, and he got him. What a play by Baez. But he made a sensational play, barehanding the ball before throwing the first. Well, he comes in, this ball's hit really slow, and I, I think he thought KB was going to get to this ball. Chris could not because it kind of bounces just over the third base side of the mound. He comes in, makes a throw, and looks like he kind of twists his ankle a little bit as he lands after the throw. Ground ball up the middle. Fielded by Russell. He got him all on a play. Descalzo on the bare hand pick. Hernandez thinks he might have beaten it. No doubt the Phillies will check with a video room, but for now, he's out. Yeah, uh, with his speed, I'm really surprised they were able to get in there at second base. Uh, beautiful play by Addison Russell. And they did get him. Uh, High-speed replay powered by Xfinity. Pitch to Baez. Line! Cubs win! It only took El Mago one pitch tonight. Three to the final. After a night of frustration with a lot of base runners left on, especially early, they rally here in the ninth. They feel good W. And we said it at the beginning of the inning. They had the right guys up. Bryant, Rizzo, and on down the line. And then finally Baez off the bench with the game winner. Center field, Wynn's going to grab it, and it is gone! First career grand slam for Almora, 7-3. Talk about it all night long. A lot of traffic sooner or later. Somebody's going to pop one. Rizzo got one with two on. Almora does them one better. Grand salami to straightaway center field. A visit from the pitching coach. 
Now Mora jumps all over that first pitch as he so often does. And into the broccoli it goes. He watched that one fly. That's our Ford home run replay. Number five for Albert. And the fans want a curtain call. Didn't need any help. Absolutely pulverized that baseball. Oh, it was a bold offering right through the heart of the zone. Your Ford home run replay. You see the head of Irvin drop as the ball flies. Got the D. Dining practice here. The middle of the Cubs order continue to punish the baseball. He went off the Budweiser sign, he went off the D. The other night, he just about hit his name in the batting yeah. order this time. The cement mixer slider, and here's your forward home run replay. Boom! Anything you can do, I can do better. Game on. Can kind of be delivered, and then he just kind of goes quickly. In the air to deep left. Brantley will watch it go into the Crawford boxes. That ties the game at 1 1. Welcome back, Jay Hay. And Hayward has tied the game with his eighth home run of the year. It's one to one here in the second inning. A little change up from Martin and it stays away and Hayward just goes right with it and just shoots it the other way. And in a lot of ballparks, this might just be an extra base hit. But here in that short porch, it ends up a home run and a good piece of hitting by Jay. I mean, it's very short and straight left. Here's a drive to right field, well hit. Back goes the right fielder, Fisher to the wall, gone! Addison Russell, a home run. Cubs go back to back. Addison Russell starting to look like the Addison of 2016. That is his third home run in the last third, the last three games that he has started. It's seven out of his last 11 with three home runs now. Toyota home run replay. They go back to back and both to the opposite field as that trend continues. Bodie, fly ball to left. They've hit three in the inning. The Cubs have homered three times in the inning for Bodie his fifth of the year and he got all of this one. Reset that replay cam. I'm trying to go down and away and it's in and up a little bit you know, in a vacuum not a horrible pitch and in the right ballpark and out but in this ballpark. Four bases for Bodie. Did you enjoy that video? Make sure you check out these other great videos. Hey, Cup fans, don't forget to click. Cubs fans, Make sure you subscribe.